do is um, get you a block of wood, a solid block of wood, and and drill out the holes and insert the flashlights in there snug. And if they don't fit snug, just put some rubber like I have right here on this one so they can fit. See that? This didn't fit in there right. So I was trying to put four flashlights in the middle. And uh, what I ended up doing is putting only three. Put this rubber little casing here and they fit snug. Um, you don't want to put them in there permanently, you know, because you probably gonna have to take them out and replace them or or uh, change out the batteries but that's an emergency lighting system what I plan to do is is just get a a, um, a filter a blue filter to give it that daylight effect and this is my secondary one which I'm building here um, and uh, as you can see, I, I paid a dollar each. And when you're on a budget like myself, you know you can you can do that. You know, instead of spending spending uh, spending two hundred dollars on a light system, you can make your own. There you go. Go ahead and do the test now. Okay, this is the finished product. Not the camera, but this lighting system. Uh, what I plan to do is uh, I purchased these flashlights at Fry's Electronics, and they are the name of the flashlight is Miracle Beam. And they're very bright. I, I have to put a diffuser in front of it, which I put here with Velcro. It's not sticking very well, but as you can see, this uh, diffuser here. And there you go, right there. And then I put another one inside of it um, to diffuse it even more. Or to turn off the lights, turn off some of the lights, I can... Uh, control the the amount of light coming in um, I have made two of these and that there are seven flashlights in here which give me enough light a lot of light actually and um, they are very bright as you can see even in daylight uh, good Okay, there we go. Anyway, uh, they give off a lot of light, and with a diffuser, I will be able to control that. In an emergency, you don't have any electrical power out there. Right? So, in a in an area where you're you're videotaping you need uh, emergency lighting and you don't have any electrical outlets then these would come in handy and for ten dollars for ten dollars you can make your own your own uh, emergency lighting battery operated lighting now of course uh, if you're making money at this uh, you can spend the money on, on the batteries, it's okay. Or what I plan to do is I plan to do an external battery. I haven't designed that yet, but some wires coming out of the black wires coming out of the uh, flashlights and then have an external battery connected to an external battery and maybe power on, off, switch. And... Uh, As you can see, as you can see, um, what I did is I just drilled a hole here and uh, tied it off. 
these little tie. And these batteries fit snug in the, into this plastic, hard, hard plastic. Uh, what you can do is get you a block of wood, paint it black, and and get a drill out the holes, uh, measure, uh, draw out the circles, and measure it 